Hi, this is Daniel and today I'm going to show you how you can remove the background audio noise from your videos in DaVinci Resolve. Ok, so let's say that this is our audio from which we would like to remove our background audio noise. In your case, of course, you can have your video track above as well, but as we are working with audio only in this video, we will work with just this audio track. And this is how you can remove your background audio noise from your videos. Ok, so as you could hear, we got quite a lot of background noise in this audio track and mainly in those quiet passages. So how we are going to apply the noise reduction feature? In case you would like to apply your noise reduction for the full audio track, in our case the audio track 1, for this you can go to this note icon Fairlight, then you will check at which audio track you got your audio, in my case it's the audio 1. And therefore we will go towards the mixer at the right, in case you cannot see this, you will have to turn it on at the top right. So I will click on mixer, then we will find the A1, what stands for the audio 1, where we got our audio track, and I will click on this plus close to the effects. So I will click on plus, then I will go to restoration and noise reduction. As you can see, this noise reduction window just popped out, but let's say that you would like to imply this effect on this clip only. So not for the full audio track, but on this clip only. So I'm going to delete this effect. So I will click on this arrow, delete the plugin, and then I will go back to edit. And we want to apply this audio effect on our audio track. So I will go towards the effects at the top left, audio, fair flight, and I will find the noise reduction. So noise reduction, and I will simply drag this on my audio, just like this. Once again, the same window popped out. So whether you want to impact the full audio track or only one clip, you can decide which of those two ways you will actually use. Okay, but as you can see in this window, you get multiple settings with which you can play. Here you get preset that we are going to use. The A and B allow you to try out and compare two noise reduction edits against each other. So we are going to use those because firstly I'm going to show you how the auto speech mode would sound like and then I'm going to show you how to use manual as well. Then of course you can enable or disable this noise reduction effect. You can listen to noise only in case you would need. Here you can choose whether you want to use the auto speech mode or the manual mode. We are going for this in a second and then at the detection we got a threshold where we are setting from which levels we want to mainly reduce the noise then we got their attack this feature controls how fast or slow the filter reacts to when it hears noise sensitivity is another great feature but it's good to leave it at the default adjusting the sensitivity tells the noise reduction how sensitive it should be to the noise it's listening to and lastly in detection we got here ratio ratio controls the attack time of the signal relative to the attack time of the noise profile while a faster ratio might help preserve short spaces between your dialogue the result can sometimes mess with the accuracy of the noise reduction. And lastly, we got their output where we can see the dry slash wet. This controls how much of the effect is applied in the audio. Dry means that there is a little to no effect in the mix, while the wet mix has a good amount of presets. If you will set it to too little, you won't hear your effect, and in case you will choose too much, your clip might get a little muffled. And lastly, level allows you to adjust your output to make any correction needed. Okay, so those were all the settings you can play with. And now let's remove the background audio noise from our video. Let's disable the noise reduction and let's play once again our audio track solely. And this is how you can remove your background audio noise from your videos. Okay. So this is how the original audio sounds like. Firstly, we are going to simply apply the auto speech mode. With the auto speech mode, you can simply play the track and it will automatically make adjustment for you to hear. What means that I will simply check the auto speech mode and the software, the DaVinci Resolve, will use the noise reduction for me. Of course, I have to enable the noise reduction first, once again. And then as we check the auto speech mode and noise reduction, I can now play my audio. And this is how you can remove your background audio noise from your videos. As you can hear, we got much less of the noise in the background. Now, in case we would like, I can listen to noise only. That means we will hear all the noise that was removed. 
and we can hear that quite a lot of noise mainly in those quiet passages were removed. So now in case I would like to optimize this I can play with all those settings around but mainly I would like to try what in case I would set this on the 100% wet. That means that we will imply the noise reduction on 100%. So let's play it now. This is how you can remove your background audio noise from your videos. And now you can hear that there is so much less noise in the background in comparison with the original audio. Background audio noise from your videos. Okay, so this is actually the first way how you can remove your background audio noise from your videos. But in case it's not optimal, that means you still can hear some noise in the background or it's somehow destroying your main audio, you can try the manual mode. So for this I will switch towards the B to not actually imply the auto speech mode that we just tried and we will try the manual mode. For this in case I want to use the manual we need to firstly learn the DaVinci Resolve how the noise in our video sounds like. For this it's best when you have the part of your video where you got noise only. For me it's for example this end part of this audio where we can hear only the noise. So now all we want to do, I check the manual, I will select this part of the audio. That means I will click on I at the beginning of this quiet passage. So I at the beginning, O at the end, and then I will make sure that I will check this loop icon. Thanks this, when we will learn the DaVinci Resolve how our noise actually sounds like, this will go as a loop through this passage. So now I will check the learn and I will play this audio track. Okay, so as you could see, we ran few times through this passage so that the DaVinci Resolve can learn how the noise actually sounds like. And now I can check the learn once again and I will select the all audio part because we want to listen now towards the full clip. And now as I turned off the learn, it will imply everything it learned towards the full clip. And when I will play the audio, and this is how you can remove your background audio noise from your videos. As you can hear, it removed the majority of the noise in the background. So this was the original with the noise reduction turned off. And this is how you can remove your background audio noise from your videos. This was with the auto speech mode. And this is how you can remove your background audio noise from your videos. And this was with the use of the manual and learn method. And this is how you can remove your background audio noise from your videos. So in the end it's up to which of those you will choose to use for your videos. Different videos, different situations can require a different method and different settings to apply for your clip. But in the end it's up to which of those you will choose and which will fit your needs the best. Okay, so that's all. This is how you can easily remove the audio background noise from your videos in DaVinci Resolve. So that's all for today's video. Really hope you found that what you were looking for. Hope you are good and video fine. Thanks for watching and all of the support and see you all next time.